that, things are about to get really interesting. It's come down to a battle of attrition right now. Yeah, it can really go either way at this point. Man, what a struggle. Tell us your thoughts on Daniel Bryan. Definitely looking confident in this one-on-one -on -one environment. We're going to find out a lot here tonight. Head to head, no excuses. Let's get it on. Uh-oh, I mean, there's nothing like seeing somebody go flying through the air. A great European uppercut. Oh, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you can find yourself in a world of hurt. Did you hear how his leg connected? Well, we're on the move here. Not today, too fast. You don't want to get caught outside the ring for too long. What happened to you? You used to love being outside the ring. He wants to do this in the ring. And I don't blame him one bit. He'll be feeling the effects of that for a while. Inside the ring again. Yeah, and they should be. This is where the action needs to be. You have to wonder just how widespread the back pain is. We'll find out soon enough. No kidding. This is bad. Whoa. Oh, out of nowhere. Quick thinking to avoid that. And this heartless attack continues. Oh, man. This is getting tough to watch. Four. This guy's kicks are so impactful. Oh. I'm not sure I can watch this. Six. Back between the ropes. Attacking from the top. Seven. Oh, my gosh. Oh, he probably cracked a couple ribs on that landing. When his strikes land, you can feel it in the first few rows. That landed like a ton of bricks. Three. A kick to the gut. That'll double you over. Oh, wait. Nice reverse. Oh. Back in the ring now. Yeah, let's just see how long they can keep it in the ring. This guy can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with anybody. Well, out here, you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake. Incoming. Too fast. Nice reversal by Brian. Yeah, that's where Brian's quickness really pays off. And there's an extremely destructive strike. You gotta be kidding me. I can't believe this. We may have just seen a career come to an end right here in front of us. No kidding, Cole. This looks bad. Somebody's gonna get hurt in this match. Oh! Now, who does a methodical pace benefit, King? Well, I'll tell you, whenever the dominating competitor takes his time, it gives everybody a chance to catch their breath. Well, Daniel Bryan certainly has had memorable pay-per-view moments. Daniel Bryan versus Dolph Ziggler from 2010's Brad Bryan. Bryan, the United States champion. Ziggler, the Intercontinental champion. Both men going a mile a minute. Oh, man, that was an awesome match. There it is. B got it. Oh, man, that's got a sting. There it is. B got it. Oh, man, that's got a sting. These superstars looking for a victory, looking to build momentum. You're right about that. Momentum is so important in a match like this. Hoping to end it early. Here's hoping. You know, Michael Cole, Daniel Bryan versus Dolph Ziggler at bragging rights was incredible. Whenever you have champion versus champion, it's exciting. Both these two superstars took it to a whole other
Oh, there it is. B got it. Oh, man. That's got a sting. Looks to me like the gas tank is at about halfway. You want to make sure it doesn't get close enough to E, though. That's for sure. Look at this. He's going back to an old friend with that one. <laughs> You're right about that. You got to remember what works. And sometimes that neck pain can be felt all the way down the spine. Man, he's still down after that move. I almost wonder if his bell got seriously wrong there. Three. Oh, come on, the ref has no idea what's going on right now. This is genius. He knows how to turn the tie of the matchup even from ringside. He'll be feeling the effects of that for a while. Five. Six. There's no quit in these guys, but unfortunately only one of them can be victorious here tonight. Quick thinking to avoid that. Eight. If you ask me, Daniel Bryan has a reason to be a little confident. He's that good. There's the suplex. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. He's in full-on attack mode Two. now. Three. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. There's the super kick. Man, and it was right on the button. Back where it belongs, inside the ring. Six. Ooh, that was stiff. Well, we're on the move here. Boy, he just got laid out. He's setting it up. Hey, he's going for it again. There it is. B got it. Oh, man, that's got a sting. Oh, man, there's the finisher. This could be it. Now that's how you do it. And this has got to be it. I think so. You have to wonder what's going through these guys' minds in a match of this magnitude. Nearly kick combo. Nearly kick combo. I love it. Check that out. That's how effective offense can be when you're able to combine moves together. There may be no stopping him. A great string of offense. You do anything you can for something to result in an advantage and ultimately victory. He goes for the quick pin attack. Count, Rev, count. Ooh, face first. We may very well be witnessing one of the greatest episodes of Raw in recent memory. Whoa, whoa, whoa! His midsection taking a lot of damage here. Daniel Bryan makes the cover. This is a level of destruction no one was expecting. No kidding, this is getting ugly. Look out below! Look out! The yes lock. Yes, yes, yes! Really going to work here. Just I don't believe the destruction we're seeing. This guy's just going from one painful move to another. Going for an encore here. Oh, man. How do you stand after an attack like this? Daniel Bryan, no problem getting out of that one. Not today, too fast. A clubbing blow. He might not even know where he is after that attack to the back of his head. 
Wow, he's still down after that. He takes to the air. Wow, if he keeps up this pace, this could turn real ugly real fast. The repetition on that move is becoming deliberate at this point. Whoa, a direct hit. Talk about getting tagged and knocked in the middle of next week. This match has been 100 mile per hour since the opening bell. Oh, and I don't see any slowing down in the future. This is a great matchup. I'm loving it. Hey, the shoulders are down. Watch it. Watch it. Oh, out of nowhere. Look at him unloading with the Dez Press. And we are seeing blood now. Daniel Bryan not unscathed. There it is. B got it. Oh, man. That's got a sting. We know what's coming here. There it is. B got it. Oh, man. That's got a sting. Boy, he just got laid out. Watch it. One more time, just in case you missed it. The shoulders are down. One, two, three. What a win. Man, he's got to feel great. You want to talk about crowd pleasing? Well, I don't know how you can pick out highlights from that match. The whole match was highlights. Let's see what happened during that incredible matchup. There was no love lost in that match. And look at the impact in these highlights. the victory here tonight love him or hate him that was an incredible match an incredible match and a big big victory i'll tell you what cole i could watch those two go at it each and every week what a match join us again next week for w Welcome back to the show. This is my guest tonight. Let's talk about the big show. He ambushed you during your own match tonight. What did that mean to you? That was cute. Does he really think he can get me riled up by attacking me like that? He's still beneath me. Enough said. There you have it. Back to you guys.
And with these three competitors, it's anyone's ball game. Here we go. All three competitors in the ring at the same time. Looking to be in great shape here. It doesn't appear as though any damage has been done. And so, what are your thoughts right now about Sami Zayn? Definitely looking good so far. Hasn't taken too much punishment up to this point. Dean Ambrose takes the upper hand here. I'm not sure, but with a miss like that, I'm wondering if he has something in his eye. Uh-oh, climbing the turnbuckle. In the mid-2000s, Dean Ambrose became known on the independent wrestling circuit for taking and dishing out ungodly amounts of punishment. To fans around the world, Ambrose emerged in 2012 as the eccentric leader of the Hounds of Justice, known as the Shield. Oh, Ambrose emerged as the leader of the Shield, all right. When they arrived in WWE, the Hounds of Justice planned and carried out vicious attacks on all of WWE's most beloved heroes. Unleashing it for the second time now. Quick thinking to avoid that. Ow. What a shot. You can hear that from a mile away. You Man, there's no getting up from that. Oh, and he got dropped. How much damage did that do? I'll be shocked if that's not it. Well, that's it. He's absolutely relentless here. While viscerating WWE's most revered figures, Dean Ambrose became the 77th individual to hold the prestigious United States Championship, a prize that dates back to 1975 in the NWA, when WWE Hall of Famer Harley Race defeated Johnny Weaver to become the first champion. You have to think that's it. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. Nobody's gonna be the same. It's over. That's gotta be it. Look at him unloading with the Dez Press. Boy, there's no way he's gonna be able to stand after that. You know, Michael, we've talked about the career of Dean Ambrose, leading the unstoppable force known as the Shield, becoming United States champion. But Ambrose had had an honor bestowed upon him in April of 2013 when he went one-on-one -on -one with the almighty Undertaker on SmackDown. Oh, that was some match. Wow, he's still down after that. Hang on. There it is. B got it. Oh, man. That's got a sting. Uh-oh. There's the finisher. This might be over. And I mean all over. Not a lot of spring left in his step right now. Oh! Oh! Usually when someone decides to use a weapon, you can almost guarantee it's not. Good Lord, he's just hell-bent on naming his opponent. Look, we don't know what Dean Ambrose is going to do next. And you want a strategy? For anyone going up against Dean Ambrose, you have to be... There it is, the super kick. You've been waiting for it. You've been wanting it. Well, you got it. He needs to dig way down deep if he wants to keep going now. Ow! Ooh. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barrier. Cage, and all of it could be used to cause massive damage. Oh, wait, nice reversal. It looked like his whole neck just crumbled there. Maneuvers like that put everybody in danger. No kidding, that's awful. Watching this beating, we can only wonder what kind of attack is next. If I were this guy, I'd stick with this attack. At this point, you think you'd have that move well scouted. Well, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you can find yourself in a world of hurt. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. I can't blame him. Keep it in the ring. Look how slow he is to recover here. That was some serious punishment. 
Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. Ow! Hard kick to the ribs. Oh! I'm not sure I can watch this. He lands the strike with great accuracy. Oh, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. Well, that steel chair has done the damage. Oh, the flesh. Look at the welts. Wow, he's still down after that. Oh, not again, not again. There's a point where all of your training goes right out the window and you rely on instinct. After getting beaten twice with a weapon, you can bet this is one of those times. He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. You have to possess a different type of focus to punish an opponent like this. Yeah, you really have to enjoy hurting someone. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. Man, I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. Look out! What a brutal drop. Situations like this push competitors to the limit. Yeah, and I think he's almost to their limit. This might not be... Oh, lights out! Wow, he's still down after that. Oh, out of nowhere! Nice submission hold here, controlling the body. This is such a painful hold. I guess he's done with that move. Yeah, but what's he gonna do next? Oh no, wait a minute, Cole, what's he gonna do here? Oh, there's another hit. Well, we're on the move here. He's got him. No wiggle room here for Sami Zayn. My God, what brutality. This match is going from bad to worse. You said it. We've seen this before. Oh, it just happened. Man, when something like that happens, your night takes a sharp turn for the worse. He's making a statement here with this attack. Turning it around, it's Sami Zayn with the reversal. Not today, too fast. I don't think there's any lengths that these superstars won't go to to achieve victory here tonight. What an attack. The enema. Oh, oh, my God. Dean Ambrose is just on a rampage. He's relentless. Now with complete control. Oh, this may very well end it. Dean Ambrose in the arm trap cross leg STF, and we're past the point in overturn. You're right about that. Dean Ambrose is going to finish this guy off. Man, talk about putting a target on someone's back. I can't wait to see what Dean Ambrose does here. Sami Zayn has eyes to finish. Sami Zayn smashes that one. What? Two. Wow, there's the save. The match continues. A reversal from Ambrose. Oh, that was slick. Uh-oh. And the offensive display by Sami Zayn. This match has taken so much out of this guy. He's not going to give up. But, man, this has been physical. Sami Zayn is conjuring up some good momentum here. You gotta be kidding me. What a slam. What a ferocious slam. Hey. And the shoulder's up now. That's a kick out. Nice. There's no keeping this guy down tonight. Ooh, what impact. Why's well, he got his opponent and what's he going for here? 
I don't know if we've seen that from him before. I mean, it's definitely a first tonight. This is great. This guy will try anything. He's going for the pin. And the referee's count interrupted there. Well, it just goes to show you that an attack can come from anywhere where you're in that ring. The Bulldog is loose and on the attack. Great move. Who let the dog out? Nowhere to go. And he lets him out. Well, he might have been losing some of his grip there anyway. He probably figured it would be better to release the hole now before his opponent could counter it. Turning it around, it's Sami Zayn with the reversal. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. It starts to feel like a broken record with that move. Oh, what a shot. That did some serious damage. You can't take too many of those and expect to be in the match much longer. I can't believe this one's still going on, especially after the beating that's been delivered tonight. And here he comes. You can never count. Looking for all the glory here. Oh, look at that. He managed to get a shoulder up. Well, like they say, Cole, timing is everything. He simply refuses to stay down. Not going to win many matches with that move. And this has got to be it. They got him. Two. And he fails to connect with anything that time. Man, that was some miss, all right. I can feel the breeze all the way up. Submission locked in. And this might be it. There it is. B got it. Oh, man. That's got a sting. I can't believe everything that's transpired thus far. It's been so physical. You're right about that, Cole. This has been an all-out war. Look at this. He's just barely moving. I'm not sure he can get back to his feet. Oh, wait. Nice reversal. Inside the ring now. Finally. Let's get this done. There's the cover. Can he do it? Think he's got it. Oh, what a save. Yeah, that's what I call killing two birds with one stone. Oh, what an offensive move. Look out, look out. This could be it. There it is, the Tiger Bomb. You're right about that, Cole, and that is painful. The shoulders are down. Let's take a look back at what exactly oh. they mesmerized the WWE Universe in that match. Well, let's take a look at some. You want to talk about crowd? Here's your winner, Cut Bryce. Please join me in welcoming my guest tonight. Let's talk about what happened out there tonight. The Authority has been very active lately. Do you have any thoughts on them? I hate them. They are nothing more than opportunistic backstabbing dogs. I'm going to do my part to throw them out of the WWE. You can count on that. The Authority era is going to come to an end by my hands. Thanks for the time. Back to you.
so much has happened already. We haven't even had a match yet. Whoa, that came out of nowhere. You know what's gonna happen now, Cole? I sure as heck don't. Oh, look at that. And a strike connects. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. Ha <laughs> ha, that's how you do it. Make a name for yourself, kid. Ha <laughs> ha, that's how you do it. Make a name for yourself, kid. Oh, come on. Is that really necessary? Is this it? Triple H knows how to polish off an opponent. I'm not sure I can watch this. Going for the big one. Nicely executed. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. And he's turned his attention. Will this distraction come back to haunt him? Watch it! And he goes right after him. Welcome back to the show. This is my guest tonight. Let's talk about Triple H. Tonight, you attacked him during his match. What was the meaning of this? This is the WWE. You make your own opportunities. Nothing is given for free over here. If I want to stake my claim as one of the top superstars, I have to go out and get it. That's what I'm doing. Things have been getting heated between you two. What are your thoughts on this rivalry? With all due respect to him, there you have it. Back to you guys.
And there's the bell. I think what we could see here is a classic chess match between these guys. I mean, one that's going to take power, speed, and aggression to win. Into the collar and elbow tie-up. Only one competitor comes out ahead here. Yeah, this is one of the classic ways to test your opponent. Daniel Bryan, deceivingly dangerous. Give us your thoughts on this superstar. Well, luckily, the body hasn't absorbed too much of an attack up to this point. Whoa. Oh, wow. I can't that was a blatant disregard for the rules, guys. worrying about long-term injuries for sure. Well, we're on the move here. Two. And he dodges that one. Three. Well, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you can find yourself in a world of hurt. What do you think is going through B's mind? Definitely looking confident in this one-on-one -on -one environment. We're going to find out who's the better competitor, that's for sure. No gimmicks here, just some good old-fashioned one-on-one action. Wow! If he can... That was a blatant disregard for the rules, guys. 